Hey everybody, how are you today? This is Stephanie with Oasis Palisades and also your intentional happiness enthusiast. Woo -woo. How are you today? How are you today? What have you done today for your soul? What have you done today for your mind? What have you done today for your body? And what have you done today for your business? What have you done today for you, for your health? What have you done today to keep that temple body of yours stronger and healthier and wiser and brighter? <laughs> So today is day 99 and we have two days left. Hey Mario, happy Friday to you too. I am very grateful that I am feeling better. I was under the weather for some days and so I missed a few days of tap being live, but I posted some videos um, so we can keep up. Somehow I think I am off. I think I started a day too soon because if today is day 99, how can we have two days left? Somehow I knew all along the math was off, but I couldn't figure it out because I checked and I was, um, count the countdown is correct. It's just, I think I started a day too soon. So, um, so forgive me. So I guess we will be doing this for 101 days instead of 100 days. So um, I, um, way before this started, um, my mentor Greg Reed had posted something where he had said that it takes 21 days to develop a habit and 90 days to create a lifestyle. So I thought, well, shoot, we have 90 days, we have 100 days, over 100 days left till the end of the year. Why don't we do a countdown and why don't we do some tapping affirmations? Because I know that for me personally, I am always um, working on myself, um, my business coach Casey and other mentors, they say that m all successful people have multiple, most successful people have multiple streams of income. Um, I know that I also have multiple streams of income, but there are areas where I can always use or we can always use uh, assistance. Um, for me, it is sales. Um, I am a work in prog a positive work in progress when it comes to being a productive sales person. Um, <laughs> so we've been tapping for abundance, miracles, confidence, um, procrastinations, productivity, uh, what else? Uh, let's see the list here. Uh, goals, focus, miracles. So I figured those are all things that we could use help with, especially myself, self therapy, tap therapy, blab therapy, or actually blab therapy started as a place for me and whoever to come and just be, talk, dance, sing, cry, whatever, hang out. And so um, I think just talking sometimes just is cathartic and it relieves whatever, same as with the tapping. Um, and also affirmations. Affirmations are actually um, rewiring the brain. Let me see if I find... I have so many notes everywhere. Affirmations are statements we say out loud or in our mind that express a positive state or experience that we would like to achieve. So 
That is what we have been doing for 99 days now. We have been tapping affirmations and also learning a acupressure point. So today's self acupressure point is Spleen 10. And Spleen 10 is located four fingers from the, let me get my acuman. So on your own, um, so you take the kneecap, inner, so inner, so inner kneecap, measure four fingers from your own kneecap, and then that is where the point is. So measure four fingers from the kneecap, and that is where the point is. Sorry if we're a little suggestive here. <laughs> so four fingers from the inner knee is where Spleen 10 is, and Spleen 10 is good for balancing mood swings, relief sugar cravings, helps regulate menstrual cycle. It's good for any gynecological issues, all, not all skin problems, but skin problems like eczema and sores, genital issues like pain, swelling, and itching. So inner, inner leg, from the kneecap, four fingers, and that's where the point is. But of course, it has to be on a person or on you because this is, you know, not a human. And um, so, spleen, ten, four fingers from the inner kneecap, and it's good for so many things. We're going to do two rounds of tapping for abundance and one round of tapping for procrastination. And if I'm going to um, share, I will tell you, I am having a hot flash. Isn't that great? Ooh. <laughs> All right, so let's do it. Two rounds for abundance. I feel more and more creative every day. I feel more and more creative every day. I am open to change and starting something new. I am open to change and starting something new. I picture abundance for myself and others. I picture abundance for myself and others. I live in a abundant universe. I live in a abundant universe. I experience my abundance every day. I experience my abundance every day. I am always supported in everything I do. I am always supported in everything I do. My creativity guides me to new opportunities. My creativity guides me to new opportunities. Every task I undertake brings me closer to my desire. Every task I undertake brings me closer to my desires. I love working on my growth. I love working on my growth. I am in the process of increasing my income. I am in the process of increasing my income. My business has infinite potential. My business has infinite potential. I am so grateful. <coughs> I am so grateful that money comes to me in increasing quantities. I am so grateful that money comes to me in increasing quantities. I am so happy that new income comes to me from multiple sources. I am so happy that new income comes to me from multiple sources. I am so thankful that I am prosperous in so many ways. I am so happy that I am prosperous in so many ways. Money is energy and a positive exchange of energy. Money is energy and a positive exchange of energy. 
I am supplied and supported in all my ways. I am supplied and supported in all my ways. Woo, woo. That's awesome. Um, can you see me, whoever might be here? Because I don't see, I have to look really quick because I don't see myself in the screen. So I wonder if something happened. Hmm. Let me check really quick on my phone and then if I'm there, then we'll continue. Tapping arm. <clears throat> Am I there? Here. Okay, I'm still here. That's weird. So we are do our procrastination. Whoop, whoop. All right. I am willing to explore new and uncharted territories. I am willing to explore new and uncharted territories. I live in the present, never dwelling on the past, and take action to ensure a wonderful future. I live in the present, never dwelling on the past, and take action to ensure a wonderful future. I clearly visualize the attainment of my goals. I clearly visualize the attainment of my goals. Hey, Anita, how are you? Thank you. I act now. I act now. I am a doer. I am a doer. I am someone who seizes the moment and takes action. I am somebody who seizes the moment and takes action. I am turning into a proactive person. This is the side of the arm, bra strap for women. I am trying, I am turning into a proactive person. I am becoming more and more productive with each passing moment. I am becoming more and more productive with each passing moment. These 99 days, I have been doing a lot of um, learning myself about affirmations in the brain and neuroscience and, and all of this and how all of this works. And <sighs> there are so many things that I've learned and have to share and I have been sharing, but the most important things that I've learned is to love yourself love yourself take care of yourself first you have to fill up your cup you have to fill up your cup full because you can't give from an empty cup it's hard to even give from a half full cup you have to go give from the overflow all of that overflow is what you can give so you got to fill yourself up and take care of yourself I've definitely learned this week with not feeling well that our health is the most important thing we have on earth. Nothing else matters really. Um, <clears throat> our health, our health is so important. So what can you do? What can you do? What can you do? What can you do to change to make a difference for yourself what can you do for your family if you're the ones buying the food for your family if you um you know it's like it's a choice um i always used to say that from the moment we wake up to the moment we go to bed everything we put in our mouth it's it's a choice it's you know it's a we have a it's that'll be for the rest of our lives right so um I don't know. I don't know what to, I don't know how to say it, but just that it's so important. And also, of course, we already know gratitude. And one of the most powerful things that um, I read was that, thank you, God, for all of my blessings I have and for all the blessings I will receive. Thank you, God, for all the blessings I have and for all the blessings I will receive. Just 
being grateful, being grateful. <clears throat> also, getting rid of the stinking thinking and knowing that when we have, you know, when we do acupressure points, we're releasing endorphins that are, you know, for pain and also, you know, like, um, feel good endorphins like oxytocin and all that kind of stuff. I have it written down somewhere else to all the different, uh, dopamine, serotonin, um, yeah. So oxytocin, dopamine, and serotonin. When we, <clears throat> when we do acupressure points, even the points that, you know, we were just learning, <clears throat> when we do acupressure points, we are actually releasing endorphins in the body. And it's the same thing as our thoughts. When we are having happy thoughts, we are releasing endorphins, neurochemicals, they call it. Uh, neurochemicals, we're releasing neurochemicals in our body that make us feel good, feel better. So positive thoughts, positive words release neurochemicals in our body that make us feel good and give us energy. And then it's also the same opposite that negative thoughts and bad thinking and stinking thinking can release negative neurochemicals in our body. And we know that. We know when we get stressed out, we get a headache or a stomach ache or a backache or a whatever kind of ache. Because those neurochemicals that are being released in our body from our stress is causing those feelings. <clears throat> I know we already know this, but it's so important to just remember to, um, as uh, Casey and YT um, say, how quickly can you get off it? How quickly can you get off it? I know I was on it um, today. We my son lost something and um, hopefully only temporary, but I know that I couldn't let it go. And, um, you know, we have to quickly get off it so we don't create those chemicals going on in our body. I mean, even me, I'm guilty, right? I'm not, not human, right? I have thoughts. I have fears I have feelings so who knows um, I uh, I am just excited to be here I'm excited to feel better I'm excited to almost be done but also I will miss it so um, we'll continue this for the next two days and then we'll see what happens so peace out be awesome, be amazing, and um, have an awesome day. I love you. Go and be awesome to somebody else because you never know what they're going through.